Assalamualaikum and salam sejahtera. I'm Irda Isila binti Yunus from Polytechnic Tunku Syed Surajuddin, Perlis. Before I continue with my presentation, I would like to introduce the author of this research paper, Muhammad Saifuddin bin Omar, co-author Chunaida binti Muhammad Chancha, and I'm the presenter for Factors Affecting Staff Satisfaction at Polytechnic Tunku Syed Surajuddin Staff Cafeteria, a case study of Polytechnic Tunku Syed Surajuddin, Perlis. Let's start with an introduction. Customer satisfaction is critically important to bring profits and revenue to the restaurant and return patronage. In the restaurant context, customer satisfaction is influenced by factors such as food quality, service quality and restaurant atmosphere. Fitria and Yuliati 2020, Rafi Zah et al. 2020, Serhan and Serhan 2019. Lee et al. 2016 mentioned that the institution cafeteria is the major determinant of quality assessment and influencing staff satisfaction and the most common complaints regarding the institution's cafeteria are poor ambience, shortage of staff, pricing, poor food choices and low food quality. Third et al. 2020 underlined that staff satisfaction in the cafeteria highly depend on food quality, staff and ambience. However, a lot of complaint about the quality of food, variety of food displayed and the physical environment with the service quality in the cafeteria. Now the problem statement and research objective. In this slide, most of the Polytechnic Malaysia provided a cafeteria for their own staff. However, a very limited study has evaluated the staff satisfaction on the staff cafeteria context. Yusuf et al. 2017 study focused on facilities and services aspects such as teaching and learning facilities, library services, student affairs and administration services, sport equipment and cafeteria at Polytechnic Balik Pulau, while Entol et al. 2017 focusing on hostel services at Polytechnic Coaching Sarawak. However, both studies focusing on student perspective. Therefore, created a gap for the study to examine the relationship between food quality, service quality and cafeteria atmosphere and satisfaction from the staff perspective at the cafeteria in the context of Polytechnic Tuanku Syed Sirajuddin. Therefore, these study objectives are first to examine the relationship between food quality and staff satisfaction, second to examine the relationship between service quality and staff satisfaction, and third to examine the relationship between cafeteria atmosphere and staff satisfaction at the staff cafeteria at Polytechnic Tuanku Syed Sirajuddin context. As for the literature review, Food quality can be defined as a necessary condition to satisfy the needs and expectations of customer. Actor et al. 2020. Food quality comprises the taste, smell, appearance, size, shape, color, gloss, consistency, and texture of the food that is at the acceptable quality property for customers. Mensa et al. 2021 mentioned that service quality is one of the key factors influence customers and plays a significant role in the service industries, especially in the hospitality and tourism sector. Usually, satisfied customers will tell people about the good services experience, while dissatisfied customers will make complaints at Agung et al. 2019. While Osman et al. 2018 stated that restaurant atmosphere can be defined as a structural element and it is one of the fundamental indications to customers judging the restaurant quality. The design of the restaurant atmosphere influences the customers' food choices and eating behaviors. Chang et al. 2014 Customer satisfaction is a determinant of post-purchase attitude that reflects a positive or negative outcome which derive from the customers itself, should eat it all 2018. Customer satisfaction is a very important element that can sustain a long-term relationship between customers and the organization in the marketing strategies. See you at all 2013. Referring to research framework indicates that variables of food quality, service quality and cafeteria atmosphere has an impact to the staff satisfaction at cafeteria of Polytechnic Tuanku Syed Srajuddin. For the hypothesis 1, there is a positive effect between food quality and staff satisfaction. 
Hypothesis 2, there is a positive effect between service quality and staff satisfaction. And Hypothesis 3, there is a positive effect between cafeteria atmosphere and staff satisfaction. This study employed quantitative research design and single cross-sectional and survey method. In terms of population, collected from academic and non-academic staff of Polytechnic Tuanku Sites Rajudin, a number of 402 with a minimum sample of 197 respondents by using stratified random sampling. The instruments was adapted from Chang and Liu 2008, Walker and Lundberg 2008, Chang and Ha 2009, Kasapila 2006, Namkung and Chang 2008. Questionnaires divided into Section A, 22 items, Section B, 25 items, Section C, 22 items, Section D, 6 items, Section E, 5 items. This study utilized 5-point Likert scale ranging from 1 strongly disagree to 5 strongly agree. This data was analyzed using SPSS 22 edition. Pearson correlation analysis and multiple regression analysis was used. Three content experts to verify all the items and ensure the validity of instruments and Cronbach Alpha coefficient to measure reliability. It shows that all variables were reliable. Pearson correlation analysis result shows that food quality, service quality and cafeteria atmosphere are positively related to staff satisfaction. Cafeteria atmosphere is strongest correlated with staff satisfaction followed by food quality and lastly service quality. Now to the multiple regression analysis. The result shows food quality, service quality, cafeteria atmosphere contribute significantly and positively towards the prediction of staff satisfaction. Hence, hypothesis 1, hypothesis 2 and hypothesis 3 are supported. It implies that food quality, service quality, cafeteria atmosphere influence staff satisfaction in the polytechnic Tuanku sites Rajudin context. According to the findings, food quality had a significant and positive impact on staff satisfaction. This is in line with him. It all 2020 found uh, food quality was significant factors in influence the customer satisfaction towards the cafeteria. This is probably because of the presentation of food and beverage offered by the staff cafeteria is attractive and presented in a variety of colors. As the Lira et al. 2020 mentioned, satisfaction with the meals served with the choice of the menu items and with the characteristics of the preparation including flavor, temperature, quantity and visual aspects influence customer satisfaction. Second, this study discovered that the staff cafeteria service quality had significant and positive impact on staff satisfaction. This is in line with Tang 2021, found service quality dimensions were significantly correlated with customer satisfaction. Smith et al. 2020 found that atmosphere has a positively significant impact on the overall customer satisfaction in their study. This positive findings is probably because Polytechnic Tuanku Sites Rajudin staff cafeteria has laid out that facilitate customer to move around easily, comfortable arrangement of chairs and tables, and also suitable lighting. Moreover, the interior design of the cafeteria is attractive, which makes the customer feel comfortable. Lastly, food quality, service quality, and cafeteria atmosphere were all found to have a significant and positive impact on staff satisfaction in the study. This revealed that to increase staff satisfaction is by enhancing food quality, service quality, and cafeteria atmosphere. This research is necessary in order to entice and retain pit polytechnic to uncle sites rather staff to dine in at the cafeteria while also increasing profit for the cafeteria operator. However, there are several limitations to this research. This study only focuses on staff and excludes all other customers. As a result, all clients will need to receive the questionnaire in the future. Second, this study solely used a quantitative research approach. However, qualitative method may be used in the future to gain a better understanding. Finally, this study only looks at three variables, food quality, service quality, and cafeteria atmosphere. Other variables such as perceived price, perceived value, and location may be included in the future.
that's all from me and again I'm Irda Yusila Binti Yunus from Polytechnic Tuanku Sites Rajudin Police and thank you.